Tuesday evening, the Hungarian parliament passed the bill on the protection of sovereignty. Representatives from the ruling parties, Fidesz and KDMP, along with the small far-right opposition party, Our Homeland, voted in favour of the law, while the other opposition parties opposed it. The justification for the new bill makes it clear that its target is the opposition parties. They are accused of receiving funds from abroad, thereby violating even existing rules on party financing. Let me quote the legislative reasoning of the bill. Quotation. Hungary's sovereignty is increasingly under attack. For years, attempts to exert influence have been observed where foreign organizations and individuals try to enforce their own interest in a country contrary to Hungarian interests and rules. Already during the parliamentary election campaign in 2022, there were attempts to influence the elections with funds directly from abroad, as confirmed by the National Intelligence Services investigation into the united left-wing opposition. End of the quotation. Clear language, clear statement. The new Bill on the Protection of Sovereignty establishes the so-called Office for the Protection of Sovereignty, which can conduct investigations at any institution, copying and taking away documents, even without judicial permission and control. The use of foreign funds in an election campaign is now considered a criminal offence, punishable by imprisonment of up to three years. Is the entire law only a form of political rhetoric or does it pose a real danger to independent institutions? The current law does not go so far as to label all institutions receiving foreign funds as foreign agents following the Russian model. However, there is a risk that the new law represents the first step toward increased government control and restriction of independent organizations and media. Several independent media outlets in Hungary protested in a joint letter against the new law, denouncing it as a gateway to political arbitrariness.